Today we are celebrating baby and here to show us a way to give the classic baby rocking horse a 21st century upgrade and give your kiddo their very first set of wheels is Ken Wingard. Oh my Ken. Ken, these are so adorable. Yeah. I think they're absolutely adorable, but before we focus on the adorability here, okay. I have to do a shout out. You know how I love you all at home. I love my Facebook viewers. John Mears, Emporia, Kansas did our four square backyard game. If you remember, I think we have oh a shot Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. So cool. Our Connect Four. That the was The Connect so Four, cute. exactly. Yeah. So the, his is so good, I showed that to the producer. She's like, well, that's the one we made. That's our garage door. It is our and garage like, door. No, ours was blue and taller. He it did, was blue. <laughs> he did a great job. So I, great might I add home. that his uh Don't is, say it. I, can I say it? No, don't. Come on, Ken. Don't it's all right. It was an inspiration. His is better than ours. Sorry. John Mears, yours is better than Ken, sorry. I just going to turn this because I love our camera. So cool. Look at how cute this is. So where did you get the inspiration for this? Well, you know, I, I was in your home country of Greece. And they're everywhere. And they're everywhere. You sort of forget about Vespas, and you go to Greece, and everyone's using them, and they're so romantic. So I became a little, like, a little Vespa obsessed. And I was like, I'm going to look up some Vespa inspiration. And I found this website, Anna White, who's been on the show. Anna White did these on her website, AnnaWhite.com. Uh, I thought they were absolutely brilliant, so I thought I was just going to share it with you all at home. And Anna, you did an amazing job. I just had to share it with the world. Uh, Have any of you cowboys been on a Vespa? Maybe not a rocking Vespa. Oh, yeah. We, we ride them all the time. Right. All the time. <laughs> You They're say, good for catching the smaller. Yeah. 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 They're more of a sheep size. One of them. Yeah. Well, these are so cool, but I mean, this looks you a little bet. difficult to me. I mean, what did what you do I here? I need one. What do you yeah, make I need you one I'll do one your size. Coming yeah. up. No, we want one like this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Actually, for your two little kids, you uh, could be yeah. adorable. Yeah. Save a horse, ride a Vespa. There you go. That's what I Yeah, do. absolutely. Yeah, we'll go with that. Well, you know, it does look complicated, I have to say. And I have to give Anna a great shout out. What she did was you go to the her website. We'll actually have a link to her pattern on our website. And you print out the entire pattern on eight and a half by 11 sheets. And you just get these sheets and all you do is you, show the camera here. Can you see that Schwartzy? You oh, tape them that. together okay. oh. and you get your entire your pattern handlebars. and the whole thing you can make out of one one by eight by ten. One one by ten by eight board. That's it. So one piece of wood will cost you 15 bucks you can make the entire thing. All right, well really? you got started yeah. earlier today. Let's, Let's see how you did it. So what you're gonna do is take all those patterns, you cut them out, tape them together, and then you just take your one piece of wood and lay them all. They'll all fit, and you'll have a little of the extra space. Trace around everything, um, and then you're also gonna need two rectangles, and I have the dimensions for those um, on our website. They're not part of the pattern. Get your jigsaw, go to town. I use this regular pine board here. Get them all done, give them a sanding, because you do want to get rid of all the rough edges, and then you'll see later their pieces are gonna get, get screwed in. I like to do pilot holes, and I just had a countersink bit on there so that those the screw heads will go in and they won't be anything to scrape. And then go ahead, I find it's easier to paint everything up front before assembling it. Then it just is a little paper doll technology, slide things in and this, you know, use your screws to fasten everything in in place. You have the two big pieces, you have the two horizontals, then you have the little details. You have the, the seat, you have the handlebar holder, um, and then the very end you've got the hub caps and you're going to put on the rockers. The rockers go one on each side. They are directionally specific so you'll see when you print out the pattern. That is really And you're basically cute. done. Um, all you're going to do then is go back and putty if you're, you know, type A, go ahead and go and putty, which we did, so it's all nice and smooth and good looking. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh. It's yeah. so, they're so incredible. And what are the, like some finishing touches you can put on to make it extra Vespa-y? Well, <laughs> you're a carpenter, right? Sure. All right, yeah. so I'm going to like Show you to wear up, sure. so so we're gonna <laughs> no put that right here. All this is a little circle. It's part of the pattern. That's oh, yeah. going to give he you an Cody, you don't seem like the power tool guy, so if you want to put on Easy that sticker now. for him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I hate to bust another finger. Hey, there there you go. Go. hey Bubba. Let's see if I can get this thing. On the off season, would you be interested in joining yeah. the Home and Family DIY department? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there, there you go. go. There you Our go. Our next DIY store. You know, let me horse graze out anything. here while we do this. We love the aesthetics on that. Okay. And then all you're going to do is a little dowel here, Schwartz, so you can see that. And this just fits right through those little handlebar. Just like that. Right, right like that. I mean, if you could, e even if you wanted to like make it even more high tech, you could even put like some 
cushioning on here. And oh, if you leather. want, oh, a little like, yeah. yeah. Right, you need to put a little it. saddle on here, like a little saddle. Have a little kid saddle. Oh, there you go. Get like you know pacifier. Yeah. Like. Just, I would like to take a look at this side by side with the real Vespa. Do we have that shot? Because that, look at that. Pretty wow. cute, that isn't is it? Super Pretty cute. cute. And then like little details, like the chrome. I just did ours with like the paint pen to get the stripes on the side. Um, some people I've seen, you know, write Vespa on the front. I thought it would be a little bit cuter instead of doing that on the front to do little a California license oh, plate stop for it. the future owners. No. So I thought a Molly oh. and an Alex no. would be absolutely perfect. Oh, oh my those gosh. are your kids' names. Yes! Oh, oh my gosh, that's so <laughs> weird. Yeah. This is nice. That yeah. is so yeah. weird. Alexandra is going to love this. I know. I was just saying that, um, like, how much Molly would love something, or just thinking how much she would love something like this. And this would make a great gift. There right? you go. She's oh, actually here today. Oh, she's gonna I'm be so happy. On this. <laughs> How much did this cost? Uh, the whole thing, 16 bucks.